Hi friends, today we are going to talk about how we can change something very important in FBL 1N that can make your life a little easier. Okay, So our main goal is to make life easier and less clicks, you know, and uh, less clicks is less mistakes. Okay, so I'm going to a transaction FBL 1N. Okay, and here everyone probably knows you check whether the vendor payments and all those things here. So here I'll go here and I'll just execute. And here you can see these are the name for this. This is the name. Uh, this is the city. Now, some sometimes you may happen that uh, I go to this transaction again. Okay, and I'll just go to uh, suppose I want it has another name too. Just just making sure it has name too. Okay, so here and here you have vendor number. And if I double click on it. Uh, so here you can see name and suppose I want to put another name okay and then say test FPL one and, okay and we click save okay now this is there. now I have a requirement that I can see only the name but I cannot see name too I want to see it in the head how can we get that okay so you can go to settings and you go to uh, layout and current header rows okay once you go here you can just click here and we can say or what we can do is we select insert row here so i can put the name to here so i can put name to and i just go around and i'll just hit save and here i click click characteristics okay and here if I scroll down, scroll down, and here I have name two, and I click, the, and I'll make it intense, and I'll make the green arrow, and I'll save it. And you see, it doesn't show here because the name two. Okay, let's execute this and save it. Okay, so go to settings, layout, current header rows. We put name two here and probably i need to didn't do anything probably i need to go to switch list and here see name two is there but that name two didn't show up because it it is in the venom master that gets updated so here name two is there you can see now what i can do is i can just go here and choose layout i go to current header row and instead i'll go here and probably I'll create a quiz and I'll put for sure. I'll put here accounting group. Okay. And accounting group will be there. And we'll just save it. We'll go back. You see the accounting group shows up as UPL. So this way you can add very important information in uh, in the header position of FPL1. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.